It's like, you know when your lash is right, you know when your face is right. Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. My name is Simone, aka Miss Super. Today I'm looking very different because I'm going to show you guys how to get the best, fanciest, most luxurious, profile picture, passport photo, DMV photo, just any kind of photo that you need to take for some legal documentation. So, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing you want is squeaky clean skin and you want your hair to be tame. So if you have straight hair, and you usually wear it down, wear it down. If you have curly hair and you wear it down, wear it down. So the first thing you wanna do is get your hair nice and neat. It's gonna be a tight photo, so you don't want anything too big. Don't try to experiment. Don't go with a crazy color. I usually wear blonde hair, but I want to look as natural as possible. So I usually wear my hair up in a bun or back. I learned the hard way to not wear my hair in a bun. So they'll tell you that your entire face and all of your hair has to be in the photo so my current driver's license photo is like so long and it makes me look so dumb because my bun was so high and when i went to go get my passport they cut off first of all they took a bomb photo of me at i think walgreens but she cut like this much of my bun off and the passport place said that i couldn't use that photo i had to pay 50 dollars to get a new photo and I had to restyle my hair in the office in like five minutes. So they were like, you have to make your bun smaller, you have to push it down, you have to put your hair back. So today I'm gonna put my hair just back in a slick bun with maybe some baby hair. I would love to like do something crazy with my hair, but I'm not going to. So I'm just gonna shellac it down, get my skin nice and clean, moisturized, toned, all of that stuff. So that's step one. I'll be right back. Okay, so this is probably the slickest that I've got my hair, like the flattest slick down that I've ever had my hair. But as you can see, like in the frame, it's gonna just be my face. I'm fine with that because having my hair up again was too much. It would like make it so that my face is so small, my hair is so big in the frame. So I don't mind this. So now we do face. You want a nice clean base, skin, looks like skin you want to just if you're going to contour just do a little concealer brows lashes gloss and then some nice earrings and then we'll get to the dressing but you know you just want it to be simple you want to look like yourself because this is going to be for at least 10 years or eight years however old you are um it depends how long it stays um on your on your license or your passport but you want to just look like yourself you know so watch me so i like to just do a little rose water let that set in even though i'm moisturized i like a moist face i don't like to look dry or cakey because if you look too powdery you're gonna look dead in your photo so you want to be a little dewy Okay, so I just put just down, down, down. You want to just pull that concealer down and then this part you want it to go up and kind of blend down. 
All right, I'm doing this. I don't know. I'm sorry. I don't know what this even does. It doesn't do anything for me. Half the time I like mess up and it's too dark. I have cheekbones. I don't need to do this. But nonetheless. So obviously your brows are so important to your face. But I refuse to get mine done because I got them done once when I was like 16, 17, 18, I can't remember. And I looked so surprised and I was crying in the middle of the mall after I got my eyebrows threaded. And so from then on I was traumatized and I will not get them done. I will not get my eyebrows done. I will not really even do anything to them because I just, it was so upsetting. It was such a bad experience. <laughs> So as you can see, I just do the best that I can and then I conceal the rest because that's life. Okay, so you kind of want to knock it out of the park with the brows. I can't really stress myself out about it, but blush is where it's at. Just go crazy because it's going to show up in the photo, but it's not going to be like too wild so you can go kind of crazy with the blush i do apples of the cheeks and then over the bridge of the nose just so i look like i'm tan and pretty and happy and it kind of like gives you a contour without contour so now i'm gonna pop a lash on because honestly lashes are just what make you like pop like that's what's gonna make your eyes pop it's gonna make you feel good when you're talking to the DMV person who probably doesn't wanna be there as much as you don't wanna be there. And it just makes you happy. So, I am running out of time. <laughs> um, because on Miss Super's channel, it's all real all the time. So I actually do have a DMV appointment today. So I'm gonna take this new truffle and just fill in my lips it seems like it's doing nothing but i feel like it's doing something okay guys so i'm pretty much done um it's a super simple look i don't plan on smiling but my last tip would be to brush with a whitening toothpaste just in case it never hurts to put your best smile forward um in case you get there and you're in a super good mood um actually last 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 tip is if you feel like you're not feeling it the picture is not about to come out good just blink just close your eyes <laughs> because they have to take it over so if you like okay and you feel like it's not gonna be good just blink just blink like blink you just be like it's not it and blink because then they have to take the picture over so that's what I plan to do if I'm not feeling it because it's like you know when your lash is right you know when your face is right I'm gonna just go for the simple super simple chin put your chin out and then tilt it down so that you're like your whole face is square to the camera instead of like I used to think down was better but that just makes everything up here look crazy so up look straight into the camera eyes tongue on the roof of your mouth you see how it just gave you so many looks <laughs> so I hope this helps I hope you slay whatever driver's license passport photo you have I hope this is a good tutorial this is my first time doing makeup on camera um, so if you like this video give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel comment follow me on Instagram all of those things because I really want to see you guys get to know you and just build this family so until next time bye